Right, this could be the sixth or seventh small video as I approach Shipham or Rowbarrow Woods. All this lot here. There is a gate up there. I'm hoping there's a sign to guide me through. I don't want to go on a nice little magical trip. I just want to walk from one side to the other. Um, I was thinking there might have been a way around there. There was a boy with a dog. But not, it doesn't mean that there is a way that way. But um, I don't want to go all the way down there. I know that would take me a while to get through. Um, and, you know, woods can be... You can get lost in them if you don't know where you're going. So I, I need to find a sign. Um, obviously, sometimes the signs disappear. So you could end up in the middle of a wood. And then they, they, they don't... It's, it's a terrible thing, actually. It does happen a lot. But anyway, here I am at the Mendip Hills, an area of natural outstanding beauty. All the villages all over the place. Um, that could be Chew Magna over there. Blagdon. Further back was... Um, um, I can't remember what it's called now. But anyway, I, I, with my naked eye, can see the, can, the suspension bridges. With my naked eye, I can. One over there and one further down. But it won't come out on air, I don't think. So I'm coming up to a gate in a minute, which hopefully will be signposted and it'll be a straightforward walk through a wood. I've been all the way down, in the past I've been all the way down there, skirting the wood to go up to the Road Barrow Fort, an ancient Iron Age fort. I've done that before and that's all videoed. Loads of photos and videos I've done of that. I tried once, I think it was with my bike, to get through this wood and got lost. Not lost completely, but the, the, all the signs disappeared, so I, I just went back. So I've never walked from one side to the other to find my way to either Rowbarrow or Shipper. So here I am. This was the plan today, to do a bit of adventuring. I could have done the long wood, but decided no, I'll do this. Further down over there, which you can't see, is Barrington Coombe, by the way, which I videoed a couple of years ago as well. And of course there are all these... Yeah, this is it, this big long track. I can remember it now. If, if I followed this down, I'd be able to turn off down the bottom to go to Rowbarrow Fort and Sanford and get home that way. Um, so lots of Christmas trees here. So all we've got to do now is follow a track one way or another. And I'm going to tend to go up that way I think. Doesn't look like there's any signposts. So they expect you to guess. Yeah, it'd be handy if they had a little map. See, that's going down. I don't really want to go down. So, I can't see a way through the middle of this either. But because that boy went up that way earlier, I'm wondering whether that would be a way to go as well. So you should really have a sign on here, really. Because if I go down there, I'll end up right the way down there. So I'm going I'm to do it up here for a bit. And see what happens. If I find I'm not getting anywhere, I will come out and just go straight down there to Robero. Um Because it's no point just trying to wander through woods, you see, without a proper path. And basically, they haven't signposted it. See? But you know where to come and get your Christmas trees, don't you? So, one gate. But I don't want to go down, because I'd have to come up again. I'd rather go up the little way first. And see if there's a turning. There's always a turning in there. Right then, well, I'll come back on when I found 
um, more likelihood of getting to my way to ship them.